bit, strangers. Now, I ain't aiming to pick no argument or nothing. Understand? Because anybody knows them old kibbered wagons look powerful slow creaking and a groaning across them plains. But let me tell you about one of them wagon trains that sought a speed record back in uh, 48. Or was it 49? Ain't been busted yet. No siree. Not even by one of your dad blasted area plane. Now we were just leaving Nebraska, going into Florida. Hold on there. Weren't Florida. We're, uh, Pennsylvania. Well, anyways, I was up ahead to scouting for engines on my old horse Hamlet. Called him Hamlet because he had a pretty bad case of stage fright. Well, we kept pushing west through New York, Buffalo, New York. When doggone my britches if and we ain't spotted by them there pesky redskins. in these whole United States gathered for a powwow. They were all of them there. A Blackfoot, an old Apache chief, yep, an old crazy horse, <laughs> and a Cleveland in Then come Big Chief, rain in the face.
I was knocking them off like flies. And another engine bit the dust. They threw everything at us but the kitchen sink. All of a sudden, we had come out of ammunition. Our goose sure was cooked. We was goners. Dead ducks. Wiped out. Massacred. Hey, wait a minute. Whoa, hold on there. Why, just when we was about to give up, along come a tornado. A twisting and a turning and a swallowing up everything. Just like one of them uh, newfangled vacuum cleaners. Swallowed up every last one of them. Wagons and all. Well, partner, that old tornado just took us across them plains and mountains. Quicker than you could say Jack Robinson. <laughs> Some of us settled in Oregon and Nevada and in California, and some of us went a little too far west. So long, strangers. Don't take no wooden engines. <laughs> <laughs> 